we just arrived at the Emirates for the Arsenal versus Porto Champions League round of 16. We've got about an hour to kick off, but the starting lineup has been announced. So I just thought I would go through the starting lineup. So we've got Raya in goal, back to normal. Why is <laughs> it <laughs> Guys, I just remember, I just remember, we just remember the goal. I remember something. But, but, Okay. Raya, save I'm us! Having yes. I'm having a good day. I'm okay. having a good day. Raya, I love you. You've changed my changed. life. Really and truly. Okay. Okay, yeah. So Raya in goal, White, Saliba, Gabriel, Kiwar, Rice, Jorginho, Jorginho, Odegaard, Saka, Tross, and Havertz. I don't mind the starting line, but I really thought that um, maybe Jesus would start on the left wing today, but it's more or less unchanged besides Raya back in goal against Brentford. We did play well. Brentford were just very, very scrummy, but so will Porto. So maybe yeah. this is the mentality. Trossard, I'm a bit scared because I love him and he's the best, but he's also, he loves, he's a bit wasteful. Yeah. And so I don't want to see him in a game like this. If I, if I see something and I'm like, I would be crazy. In a, in a game like this, if I see something and he flops and I remember and I'm like, oh my gosh, if only Trossard had done that, I'm going to be so upset. But he always comes through sometimes. Yeah, and I would have taken Hedus mainly because of his Champions League experience. I feel like for us, he always does really well in Champions League, um, especially during the group stages. But Trossard has scored for us in champs as well. So, yeah. and I love Trossard. It's just that sometimes his highs are really high and sometimes his lows are just kind of like, what are you, what are you doing? Today will be the day. Today will be the day. I feel like I have so much trust in the squad and I feel like we're just looking at the the bench, uh, we've got yeah, Zinchenko, Tomiyasu, we've got Party, Vieira, Jesus, Smithrow, and Ketia, like people that can, I guess, come on and make the difference, especially Tomiyasu. Um, so yeah, I'm kind of excited. Do we want to do match predictions? I, I've been nervous all day. Normally I'm very like, I feel excited. like the goal in the first leg was a bit of a fluke. Yeah. I think we can, if we're focused, and I think with, learning the lesson from the goal we can be focused mm. and so i think maybe one maybe they get one. Ooh, yeah. i don't want to know that means, <laughs> that means we have, like three. yeah we have to mm. i feel like it would be a one nail to arsenal or a two one mm. i'm still confident that we could get a win well i'm not 100 confident but i'm gonna back my boys so i'm gonna say yeah, we can win I think we can get a win and it's only they only won one nil. It was one nil, so and it was like a ninety it's a bit, something it's a bit minute scary to kind of give them a goal and then say we need two goals, three goals, whatever, mm -hmm. whatever. But I still think that we. I think eventually we do it. Yeah, because I even realised if I say two one, that's two two on aggregate. Yeah. So we actually have to win. So I'm going for a one nil or two nil, maybe like a nil nil at half time, but hopefully not. Like I'd rather I score think, early. Yeah, I think us one nil at half time. Yeah. Okay. And then Arsenal to win. Yeah. Okay, guys. Sure. Well, if we lose, cut us out. Yeah, cut it out. But yeah. Okay, so we're gonna make our way. Probably walk around a little bit. We've still got a bit of time. Yeah. Um, and we will see you guys. Oh, the atmosphere here, guys, is amazing. Um, I really hope like we really bring it today, and the boys are to support us. So yeah. Yeah. All right. We'll see you guys when we get in.
and say it. I just really thought that was going in. Um, yeah, just a bit of a quiet heart, quiet last 10 minutes for Arsenal. Five minutes for Arsenal. Um, we're struggling to get the ball through. They're quite compact, Sporto. already in. Come on. Come on Ben White's just made the run. Pass, pass, pass. Go on. Oh.
so it was good. I think it was because we made a mistake. You're great. Um, yeah, I'm just looking for more, a bit more confidence, a bit more pace. I feel like we've been a little bit slow on transition. Um, but Porto as well haven't been that clinical either. They've kind of sat back a little bit more. Um, but I do feel like the mistakes, the defenders for Porto have a mistake in them. Um, but let's just see what Arsenal can capitalise on that. One nail. Like I said, it was you, bro. Yeah, so we're gonna go into extra time. Porto, they cheat so much. Like they're so close. Yeah, we actually need to get like, properly like, finished off now. Um, I can't believe we stretched it this long, honestly. Um, I, I feel like the only thing is it doesn't need to be more clinical. Like we've got in, it's a good position. We've had good chances. We just haven't scored. Odegaard had that chance and he went wide. Yeah, Barcelona are through to the quarterfinals. And we're still here. That's be on my way home. Yeah. Sharp and tight on TFL. So yeah, we've got a few minutes and then the full time starts. <laughs> Alright guys, first half of the extra time has started, let's see if you can get it done, I hope you can get it done, come on just up, We are 
I feel like possession is a bit 50-50 at the moment. We're not keeping the ball, that's our issue. Um, and Porto, I don't know, I feel like they've woken up a little bit. They've stopped their time wasting antics this half when they know that they need to score a goal. Um, so yeah, like, honestly, I don't know. I don't know, I just need a goal. Um, yeah. 15 more minutes till penalty. I'm just elevated, I'm just excited.